I paint large scale paintings of glass and food and sometimes animals. And um, a lot of my pieces um, are kind of messages in bottles. There's a lot of history to the, this bottle in particular. Um, this is Lydia Pinkham, and she was a person who lived in the 1800s, and she created tonics for women with female issues. <laughs> they were non-alcoholic tonics, and they still exist today. And so she was a really early um, female entrepreneur and I appreciate that. So it's one of the things I like to bring to my work is that the bottles that I'm capturing have some meaning behind them. Some people ask me about how I get the feeling of glass when I'm working this large. I grid a canvas before I start and I create some small, I work in sections so that a piece like this is basically finished paintings all connected together over the course of this whole piece and sometimes I will do sections of letters at uh, it at a time you know some days I get three letters done <laughs> and that's the big accomplishment for the day as I'm painting it I actually don't know what I'm working on I'm looking at something on my computer and I'm creating what I see in that moment and hopefully if I've done it right as I stand way back you will see the thing that you want to see and while it's a large piece, <laughs> one of the things that I never use is large brushes. My brushes are at most this, uh, this big. So every little bit of this painting is done with a little teeny tiny brush. <laughs>